running to get the racing post. Morning, Winston. Looks like after time, Ansel. Right, we've got the RP blueberries. I'm in with Dickie Johnson. Well done, Dickie. I wonder how much Richard Johnson bench presses and squats. Strong lad, Dickie. That's a cracking shot, whoever caught that. A day beside the sea where punting is a pleasure. Sounds like fun. Oh, here he is, here he is. Mr. Robin Gibson, surf and turf. Let's see what he has to say about the blogger. This better be good, Robin. Riding this vogue of non-reticence, but not in a bad way, like Donald is Stephen Power, the racing blogger on Twitter. If you're unfamiliar with Power, don't start with the tweet from Mr. James Knight, who said, Honey G is Donald Trump, Brexit, and at racing blogger of the X Factor wins. That is funny, but unfair to blogger. Well done, Robin. That is funny, but unfair to blogger. As Power styles himself, he is inoffensive, although not to JP. He deserves it. Fairly entertaining and does not indulge in cultural misappropriation. Still, he is superficially the kind of character who compels you to ask around if he is actually a bit of a prat. Robin, tut tut my friend, tut tut. It's unclear how old Power is, but it appears to labour as a personal trainer. Anna, nutritionist, Anna Pilates teacher sir, one of the best practitioners in England. Is he 17 or 83? He's got ITV in his bio, he fancies a job on the telly. Unlike most folk who might even think about sending a CV or even a showreel in, the elaborately configured blogger just does it, broadcasting daily morning lines, videoing himself, talking to people you could talk to if you walk into the parade ring and talk to them, tweeting prolifically. He destroyed Ansel. Power puts the hours in and believes the bridge between reality and dream is work. Not so sure about that, I prefer to just go to sleep. Well Robin, I'll give you an 8 out of 10. Cracking effort sir and great work. Thumbs up from the blogger, emoji style.